Ocean Connectors is a nonprofit marine science education program for underserved youth. This program focuses on coastal communities along the Pacific Ocean that lack the means to connect local youth with the coastal environment. Ocean Connectors involves all levels of the community, school districts, children, their families, and scientific experts in the learning process. So the great thing about Ocean Connectors is that Ocean Connectors teaches their students about the animals and plants and wetlands that are found in San Diego Bay. Students get the opportunity to perform habitat restoration, they go whale watching, they visit local nature centers, and these are opportunities that low-income students otherwise wouldn't receive. We've had a partnership with them for 10 years where they bring those students here to the center to get an up-close and personal experience with those animals and plants. The Living Coast Discovery Center is a great place for children and families to explore the wetlands and surrounding habitats of the San Diego Bay. Ocean Connectors allows children to form a connection with the ocean. We work with students in areas that really don't have access to the beach, although they may live just miles from the coastline. We work with students in National City, California, as well as with students in Nayarit, Mexico. Hola, me llamo Saraí y vengo. Estoy en la escuela de Kimo y doy un mensaje que es importante proteger el medio ambiente porque queremos que otras generaciones puedan ver estos animales. Gracias. Es muy importante proteger el medio ambiente, porque si no hubiera medio ambiente, este mundo sería contaminado y no sería bueno para todo el mundo. Los árboles dan oxígeno y también hay algunos animales que se están muriendo por la contaminación. Algunos patos, gansos, que están comiendo basura en lagos, porque piensan que es comida. Y puede ser muy peligroso porque se pueden extinguir. Esto no se, tiene, no se tiene que permitir, así que hay que proteger el medio ambiente. These students form a dialogue to communicate about how it's important to protect migratory marine animals such as sea turtles, whales, and birds that travel across the Pacific Ocean. Students communicate how they can help by picking up litter, planting native plants, and telling others what they've learned. These are really valuable lessons for children, especially in their formative years. This is the plant. This is one of the plants that you guys are going to be planting with Chantal over there in the restoration portion of the field trip. Uh, I work with the kids mostly one-on-one -on -one, and so I can see firsthand exactly how excited they are to be out in nature and how much they do want to help. Oh wait, wait. Yeah, you don't have to have a microscope. You could oh my it. goodness! Holy wood. It looks like a beetle. Um, I started with the program about five years ago, so I've really been able to see the program grow and have see its effect on the kids and the environment in National City. Kimbo School and Ocean Connectors have a wonderful partnership. Um, through this partnership, I've seen this, pro this program grow since 2007. It was uh, basically started in the classrooms with a few select grades, and it's just blossomed into field trips and programs after school. One hand at the bottom, one hand right at the base, turn it upside down. Ocean Connectors is a program for fourth through sixth grade students. And this three years of environmental education programming provides the students with continuity. They form the building blocks of environmental knowledge in an important childhood time. So they get three years of programming, which means these, these are going to be lifelong lessons that students remember throughout their entire lives.
San Diego is a very rich bird community. There's a lot of bird species here. And being able to come to a site like this, look at the telescope, sit on the bench and watch the birds fly and just appreciate them, I think is really valuable and that's what we provide for the community members. This is the scientific name for your plant. Common scientific. You'll see it for the first section of the worksheet. All activities are provided completely for free, which is very important when working in underserved areas. Remember, a native plant is one that's from here or belongs here in this ecosystem. So they're good for the environment in a couple ways. They might be a habitat for birds or they might be a plant that doesn't need a lot of water. So they're good in times of drought. And there's lots of other reasons native plants are important too. We feel it's really important for the business community to get involved in National City and also with our local nonprofit organizations. The work that many nonprofits do is so critical to the overall vitality and improving the quality of life here in National City. So, for example, if a business can just commit a little bit of time and maybe volunteer with Ocean Connectors, if they can help support them, one of their field trips that serves many of our underserved populations here in National City, if they can possibly help out with the sponsorship of one of their upcoming events. I think that not only shows good corporate citizenship, but it gives them an opportunity to step out of the office and really impact the lives of the residents and the children here in National City. So Ocean Connectors strives to give all children opportunities to experience the ocean, to interact with marine life, so that they grow up caring about these animals. This also supports their academic achievement, inspires them to stay in school and to pursue college and consider, consider environmental careers as well. Please visit the Ocean Connectors website and consider supporting this important program www.oceanconnectors.org